reptilian kingdom has decided to move their war off the battlefield and onto the track for a race of most linear fashion. The name of the game is Newt Fast, Newt Furious, and you can bet they'll be burning some rock, doing some Edinburgh drifting, and racing for the illustrious pink slip. Er, parchment slip. Needless to say, there's gonna be a lot of motion on the track today, so this might just be the perfect setting to cover linear motion. Linear motion occurs when an object's acceleration and velocity are in one dimension. That means just horizontal motion, just vertical motion, or just motion along a diagonal line. Once you start combining these types of motion, it's no longer one-dimensional and therefore no longer linear. Also, keep in mind that we'll only be looking at linear motion with constant acceleration here. You can remember that in linear motion, acceleration and velocity are in one dimension, with this A-shaped chariot accelerating along the linear track, kicking up some V-shaped dust along the same track. Remember that acceleration is caused by unbalanced forces, which you can remember with this unbalanced Newt rapidly accelerating. He's got his snake on a very strict steroid regimen. Anyhow, the force of the pull by the snake is unbalanced because it is not being cancelled out by opposing forces, like air resistance or friction, with the ground. To say it in a more Newton-approved way, the magnitude of the applied force is greater than the sum of the frictional force and air resistance, or drag force, that oppose it. 